Hello there. You know, usually I have some kind of uh, notes for making a video, maybe even a script, uh, but today I have really prepared nothing uh, and I'm just gonna talk to myself for a little while. Uh, you know, I have been wanting to make this channel for quite a while. I think it goes beyond a couple of years in, in reverse. My friend Jason might be remembering when I first asked him about this idea about me joining uh, the community of creators and talking about Linux. You know, uh, I have been using Linux for a long time. Maybe it was an on and off uh, endeavor for me. Uh, no pun intended for the Endeavor OS, uh, which I have not yet tried. Uh, but, you know, uh, I started somewhere with uh, Unix in maybe 95 and then s started using Linux in 97. I'm pretty sure the years are correct. And then comes along like Windows 7 uh, and I started working for different companies and uh, everyone was asking of me to use Windows uh, everywhere for this job and for this job and somehow this Linux love uh, was diluted over time and I'm kind of r regretting this but it did give me a good chance to see how much everything evolved how much everything advanced in the meantime uh, and I'm not saying I wasn't using Linux I'm just saying that it wasn't my primary operating system uh, for a long while. And while, while it's not your primary thing that you use, then you uh, fall out of the, you know, the river of knowledge and you, you, you lose track of new things and you forget how to fix some things in the meantime. And for, for the past two years, I have been catching up a lot of things. Uh, and there are certainly a lot more things that I used to know before and I kind of forgot about them and I'm, you know, I, I'm constantly having these uh, deja vu moments like uh, I'm trying to do something uh, and change and reconfigure something on Linux and I'm like, oh hell, I don't know how to do this and then I look up the solution on the internet and then, and then I'm like, oh, I know this and, you know, this, this, these moments are really dear to me because uh, you, you know, th there are a lot of good memories from back in the day when Windows was a true disaster and, and, it, it, and it is again, uh, but I mean like the Windows 95, 98, Millennium, uh, even XP wasn't that good. Uh, all that are quite bad memories for me and Linux came into the rescue as something that just worked. You know, it required a lot of effort to set it up and actually make it work, uh, but it was well worth it uh, at the time and it still is. Uh, and th this is, you know, this is my love uh, for this operating system and, and all the things open source and free software. I kind of like the philosophy about all this I, and I like to talk about it. I like to have some com community around me that talks to me. You know, I what I love the most about this channel is comments. I don't care if you uh, tell me like, what, what's, what's up with the stupid hat? Why do you wear that? Or if you write to me like, this is my favorite channel ever. I have seen both of these kinds of, of uh, comments on my video and I love all of it. I love seeing the comments. I love to see engagement. Uh, I, I love to respond every single one of your comments. The only problem that I have with comments is how YouTube makes it, uh, s uh, you know, when uh, you uh, type a new comment, then I can see it with the unreplied comments. And so I can reply to all of them and then the, they disappear from the list so I can focus on the new ones. But if you reply to my reply, then I don't see it. And then I have to go out of the YouTube creator page to the normal YouTube and I have to search for your replies there and I do that really often but it takes a while and it takes some time to uh, find all of the replies that I haven't 
it, it's a bit complex, but I blame it on YouTube. Uh, on PeerTube, it's a bit easier. I can just see them all in one list, and I can see uh, clearly which I, which ones I haven't replied. Although I don't get so many replies on PeerTube, so I would uh, kind of ask you if you can drop a reply. I would love to have some more engagement on that side as well. I'm not that big of a fan of YouTube, uh, to be honest, but you know, when you need to find the audience, uh, it's just where you all are for some reason, uh, and this reason is well known, but it is what it is. If I can shift things to move more into PeerTube, I would love it to happen, but I think it will uh, take some time until that happens. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm just checking out um, uh, which of my uh, videos I are doing good. Some of my uh, how-to videos have done very badly, uh, which is unfortunate because I was hoping that I would make more of the how-tos because some people actually do ask me how to do some things and I can make some uh, videos about uh, how to do things. It's, it's uh, knowledge that can be shared, right? Uh, no matter that uh, there are other YouTubers and content creators who make the similar solutions, but you know, the more the merrier, I think. Uh, but some, for some reason, these um, uh, how-to videos don't do very well. What I did notice is that if I hate on things, those videos tend to do very well. So I suppose people like drama. And I'm not too afraid uh, or too ashamed to put some drama on this channel, but I think it needs to be warranted uh, before uh, inventing drama, if you know what I mean. If something is truly not good uh, in the Linux community, I will have the balls to point my finger. But, you know, if something is just uh, artificially generated on my end, I, I don't want that kind of engagement on this channel. It's not, uh, it's not healthy and this, this is not really who I want to be, you know. Uh, so if that makes me less followers, less uh, subscribers, less views, I mean, so be it. I, I, cannot, I cannot change who I am. This is just what it needs to be, right? Uh, I, I'm enjoying to make this channel. I'm enjoying uh, making these videos. I have been playing a lot of video games for many years. And ever since I started this channel, I have had a very little time to play video games. And I'm not saying this as a bad thing. This is like, uh, this is something that gives me proof that I really enjoy doing this because I invest my free time in my hobbies. So be it uh, watching movies or riding a bike or uh, playing games or making these videos. This is all uh, that mixes in, in my inside my free time. And, you know, the thing that comes out on top is what I enjoy most. And this is what I enjoy doing. Uh, I think uh, this is a good moment to wrap this video up. I wasn't even planning to talk this much and I think I'm not going to cut anything uh, out of this video, just like uh, play it all at once uh, for you. So I do want to ask you just one thing and that is please give me a comment and I'm gonna see you in the next video.